Hey, it's Benja. Hope you're doing great. Today I wanted to make a short video about a really useful free asset I found while browsing the Unity Asset Store for new tools. It will probably make you wonder why this isn't built in Unity. It's really simple and will probably make your life a bit easier when navigating big projects. I'm talking about colorful hierarchy category game object. Like the name suggests, this asset will let you put colors in your hierarchy. I'll show you quickly how it works and how I like to use it. Once installed, you'll find it in your assets folder under M Studio. I created a fake, badly organized project to show you how you can use it. It's pretty straightforward. Open the color palette. There you can see a few color designs ready for you to use. For each one of these, you'll find the characters you need to type in at the beginning of the object name and the style it will provide. Easy, right? You can of course modify these or add your own. But let me show you how I like to use it. I like to use separators. Most people I see will either use equal signs or dashes. I can use these symbols as characters for a color design and it will automatically color my separators. If for some reason I use different symbols for my separators, I can easily duplicate an array to keep the same settings. I only need to change the character field. Another way I like to use it is with actual names of UI elements. I know that my canvases can be quickly overcrowded with texts. I like to create a color design for the word text. Not only will it modify all my existing texts, but it will now color my new texts as well. Finally, I don't like to have to remember what symbols I must use for each style. I prefer to use abbreviations. For example, I like to use GM for my game manager. I'm sure there are plenty of assets like this one and you could do way more with it. But in my case, this one works just fine. I hope you find this video useful. If you wish to see more videos about free assets, please let me know in the comments. Until next time, take care.